Hey guys, what's up? It's Apollo here, and welcome back to the battlefield, and we are once again playing Napoleon Total War. This is the continuation of our charity challenge. The winner of this challenge, uh, or I, I should say the loser of this challenge, will have to pay $100 to the winner's choice of charity. Now, this is battle number two out of three, so it's best out of three, actually. So, if you miss the first battle, do not watch this one. Go watch the first one first. It's on the pyramids. It's really epic. You don't want to miss it. Now, for everybody else, we are going to be playing a battle on the battlefield of Austerlitz. Now, there is a massive snowy hill in this one, and the enemy team Fish and Chips are going to be holding that hill. They are playing as France and Sweden. Now, General Cody and myself, we are going to obviously attack the hill. I am playing as Prussia, and he... General Cody is playing as Russia. So guys, do not forget, there's links down to all the YouTube channels involved in this battle. Also, there are links to the charities we are fighting for in this charity matchup. So if you want to support one of those charities, please do, or both. That would be awesome too. So guys, sit back, relax, get some snacks and drinks. We're going to start the battle right here in the deployment phase. What if we make them choose so what if you go to the extreme far right i go to the extreme far left sure sure that's a good idea okay i like that that way but the only bad side to that is that we can't support each other oh dude they're not coming off that hill <laughs> well <laughs> yeah that's true just just be ready to protect everything yeah got it, got it. and also on on your far left flank if they're out of how it's arranged from you uh you got that nice deflate you can put your cab on the back side but... oh that's true yep yeah. yep I have one on my right, so I'm gonna try and squeeze my cab there. If it's out of range of howitzers, if not, I'm gonna just keep them far back. Yeah, this is like D-Day. You just gotta keep <laughs> moving, you know. Yeah. <laughs> just... well, you know, watch them bring normal armies now. You now our armies. Hey, are up. <laughs> I'm fine with that, honestly. Yeah, yeah. Well, maybe not because we don't have any artillery. Like, uh, regardless, if they bring a normal army or not, we have to be aggressive. I feel like you'll be fine on this side. I feel like uh, I'll be dealing with a fair bit. No, so I, I I added another unit of line or of elite infantry to oh, yeah. to the Jaegers and the Dragoons that I'm sending to your left. Wait, so that's all you're using for your side? I have I have reserves. And those reserves are on my side or are those? Just no, the no, it's it's the four side. units of line that are behind the howitzer. Those are my reserves. Okay. Short of them, like, straight bum-rushing melee, which is going to take them a while because even their infantry moves slower in that snow, um, that'll hold That'll hold them no problem. Right. I'm sorry, guys. We're doing it again. <laughs> We're doing the same tactic again. And they know. They know. They knew it. They knew it. <laughs> they, hide, they hid. No. Okay. Whew. All right. Give it to them. They're out of range, actually. Bounce it, dude. I'll bounce it, but they're out of range. Bounce it, bounce it, bounce it. Oh my god. Okay, the, okay, I can move. I can move really. Okay, I'm going really hard here. Okay. Because they don't. I mean, unless they're hidden, right? Okay, let me see what artillery they got. So, okay. But, oh, dude, they don't have howitzers. Oh, oh beautiful. My cab, though. Oh my gosh, dude. Yeah, you just focus on Cody as much as possible with those guns. Because I can, I can crisp up Apollo. Okay, so Apollo's got one, two, three units of cav. Kind of in the middle. Uh, nope, four units of cav. All right, Apollo brought four cav units. Four. Oh my gosh, he's wrecking my cab right now. Oh, this is not a good feeling. And there's no place to hide. <laughs> you just gotta keep moving, yeah. There's no place to hide. Yeah, hey, hit Apollo's cab that's coming down. Yep. Or coming up. Yeah, he, you're right. He brought a ton of lights. So what do you recommend? Like, yeah, just get my infantry really, in, in really his face? Aggressive. Yeah, really aggressive. I would push that left side so you kind of have an even playing field. Yeah. I'll be playing a ton of stakes. Oh, he's got howitzers, so spread the, the cap thin if you can. Yep. 
I messed up bad. No, no, you're good. Yeah, I see, I see. And with Sweden dedicating so many resources on the right, it should make it a little bit easier for you for that push. That's true. Um, but yeah, just, just get in there with your wines and just duke it out. Oh, shit. I just ambushed a bunch of Apollo stuff. What's up? What's our shit? Uh, did you do all that damage to us, Crusty Years, or was that me? To whose? Apollo's. Me. Okay. He, he didn't, I don't think he realized, I don't think he saw all my troops that were hidden. Right. I didn't expect him to be here, so my army kind of ran into his men, unfortunately. All right, I'm gonna be focused on Apollo, so you gotta tell me if you start needing help, all right? I will. Oh, he's limbering up. Oh, he's limbering up. Oh, that could be a big mistake. Hang on, let me see what I can do here. Cool, okay. I'm gonna, f I'm gonna go center them. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you see, if you see a window. Yeah, he goes left hand side, yep. by the way. Yep, I see him. Just a howitzer. The howitzer does fucking a crap load of damage to them. Oh, he's got... Oh, he's limbering everything. Can you get Cav in the middle, or is that too far of a... I can do it. I can do it. It might be a little behind. It might take That's a little fine. while. Fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no worries. Um, but I'm going now. I didn't realize you had to place that many from your right. I'm sending my dragoons over. I don't think they'll get there in time, though. I think he's shitting the bed right now. Really? How's it looking over there? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, dude. He's going for your howitzer crew. Yep. Can't save it. I'm melting them over here. So whatever you're doing, you're doing good. Keep them busy. Oh man, my mic ring is awful right now. It's it's a wild map, you know. He killed his own general. Cannon. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. Alright, his cast busted and gone. Your general died. Alright, but his uh, his shit's busted and gone. He's still going. Alright, I really need that line on the far right of Apollo's. Apollo's far right or? My far right, uh, Apollo's 8th life regiment. Need that shelled. Yep, I need it shelled. I gotta get my battle line set. Um, my guys are exhausted. They, they got a huge advantage right now. Apollo just charged the square formation. Jump first, that was a big mistake. No way did he form square. Uh, start focusing on those slicing solution because he uh, he's trying. To, oh no! Hit that! Hit that lifeguard! Still, they just stopped. That life and foot guard just stopped. Yep. The man of fatigue, sir, a must he's doing the canister, you bastard! You bastard! <laughs> uh, Ulan's right in front of one of your guns. Or hussars, hussars. Thank you. Turning hay. They're not turning. 
Oh, your calf's just sitting there on the hill. Oh, oh shh. Oh, no. I completely forgot. You did, you did, you did. Huge. If you can just disrupt that for as long as possible, okay. I'm gonna run my guys up the hill, dude. They're gonna be used to bolting it. <laughs> okay. Get him. Get your guys back on the guns. He only killed twenty. He only killed four of them, and he left. Oh, he's got more hussars coming up the hill. Yep. They're about to run into the line of fire from my Jaegers. It's alright. I've got another cav unit. Actually, I'm going to charge his infantry. He's old guard. I don't think I'll see it because he's so focused. Oh, God. Damn. Keep, I would keep going up that hill because it's uncontested. Well, he's got you. Never mind. I'll take it back. I got his old guard. Uh, you need to start using case on those uh, Russians coming up. Yeah, yeah. I'm getting out of your way. That 12 pounder. That's uh, that's the furthest left. Uh huh. Oh shit! My fucking dragoons chase the enemy all the way down the hill. Uh, so they're behind the. They're behind everybody's army now. <laughs> If you can get that uh, cap or uh, Artie. All right, I, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna lose this. If you can't, no, no pressure, but ah, he's got it blocked. Sweet, I just char I just got a back charge on his Semenovsky lifeguard. I'm even gonna send my general in. Oh, he charged his fucking gen in. I'm sick of telling my guys to start firing. It's like, oh no, but we have to reload, sir. Don't you understand? Hey, fucking Apollo's got Cav getting around behind me. I'm just about gone. Yeah, that howitzer's not, though. I reached this grand battery. Wait, where are you? Uh, top of the hill. Oh, no, 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 I'm sorry. I'm uh, sorry. myself. You're good. Is that your general? Yeah, right. yeah. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, wow, my land there kicking his Jaeger's ass. But looking pretty good for you on that side? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Charge! Follow scabs come in. Uh, my howitzers are not turning, dude. Okay. They're just straight up refusing. Okay, just keep firing them as much as you just fire at whatever they'll fire at. What will they fire at? That's the question. Okay, this is gonna be. Uh... Oh, oh, hey, 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 calf, calf. Uh, uh, where, where, where? Uh, I don't know. Is this my general? What is this? Wait, I have musketeers over here? Oh my gosh. <laughs> One of my units of line infantry is defeating some of his elite and some of his other shit. Bring that, turn that 12 pounder that you have on the hill. Can yeah. you pull that back towards me? Pull that back towards your howitzer, towards my gen. Lifeguard a foot. Lifeguard a foot against old guard. That'll be a good matchup. Hopefully, win that one.
Good job. Good job with that case from your howitzer. Oh, did it do something? Oh, yeah. It just it fucking hammered a bunch of Apollo's calf. Oh, my gosh. How's it going over there? Uh, it's going all right, I think. The man of the this is a messy. It's like, not only... Do we have to charge this hill, but it's snowing, which is making it harder. I'm going after Apollo's gen with my cat, with my dragoons. There we go. That's what I like to see. Oh my gosh. If I can just get through this. Oh my gosh. I've got one unit of line infantry having like a last stand fight. Fucking. <laughs> Where's some. Dragoons? Where? Up on Scrassy S. They're charging you. Yep, see it. And uh, his uh, tower size. Oh, his cap's getting around you? Yep, and I see it. Who's going to ammunition, um, huh? Yeah, careful with your cap. If you want to save that for later, actually, I'll take that back. He's got lines there. I I'm. You know, I'm just gonna. Go way behind or, or, you know what yeah yeah because he's got that second artillery in the back without any protection if you can make it there that'd be big yeah i'm gonna come over and help you okay yeah if you can hit that french arty in the uh the very back that's limbered that would be big oh yeah i see it i see it i can try Cody's lifeguard foot come down the hill i'm actually going to charge him with my this mentioned cannons. Oh, Apollo step coming up the hill. Apollo, uh, you're, you're gentle, Yep. Oh, he's got a hidden cap. Or, uh, man, okay, he's got a hidden skirm unit. I just. Alright, I'm going for his general. Okay. Charging in his 12 pounder foot artillery crew. Oh, there we go. Nice. Ah, he's cap charging the other lifeguards I got in, in combat down there. General died. Yeah, because if you can charge his, uh, actually charge his lights if you can. I'm gonna melee charge his, his arty. Okay, okay. Oh, you, you cleared him? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're doing good, man. You're doing fine. Holy crap. Oh, hell yeah. I beat his... Nice. His foot guard. Okay. I'm rushing in here. Literally. Yep, his cab won. He's coming to charge the back of me now. My cannons won't fire until the wagons are out of the way. I'm about to fire on his cursors with my Jaegers. Can you, can that howitzer fire case or no? Uh, you got guys coming straight up the hill at you. I'm gonna have to wait because there's a hill in my way. My, this is running, dude. This is full speed running. <laughs> 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 They're so tired. Oh, I'm trying to break through, dude. This is off. Come on. He's about to shoot. Come on. He's gonna pull the primer. I got him, I got him. Nice, nice. He's full on infantry charging down here. <laughs> oh man, if you hadn't if you hadn't moved all those cannons at once, we'd have been fine.
but he got you to he, he got us to flinch. That's all it took. Because if you'd have had half of those cannons in place still, they'd have fucked his cab up coming up that hill. But if I left half the cannons in place, he would have come up that side of the hill. I know. He'd have gone around. That's a, which is fine. We were we were. I had planned for him to come around that way. That's why I had my dragoons on the back side like that to stop to at, at least be able to even slow something down if need be. Dude, let's go. 2 0, baby. <laughs> oh. I'm not a fan of this. We got some work to do. That was crazy. I, it, the way you were talking, because I wasn't watching you at all. And the way you were talking, I thought you lost. Yeah, it was tough, dude. It, the, the, you, you were my saving grace with that cavalry charge in the middle there. Uh, I don't, I don't, I didn't really do much. No, seriously though, I, I, I would have gotten just absolutely blasted with this canister. You got more kills than Cody did, still. Yeah. Oh yeah. Dang, dude. But you had to. You had to take oh, the yeah. losses oh, yeah. to be able to get that artillery. Me. Dan. No, nah, he's not here yet. Oh, he Dan, you're trash. Oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Look at that KD, man. Oh. Pretty good KD oh. with all that. All that Artie. Oh, yeah, you man. see, that one we were hoping to use the, uh, we were hoping that one was going to be the tiebreaker, what we brought. Yeah, that, that, uh, I mean, we knew you were bringing the arty again, you know? Yeah, see, well, uh, throughout <laughs> the day, throughout the day, I thought we were going to play that card once. Um, but, uh, yeah, no, apparently it was, uh, two. <laughs> hey, well, um... That was definitely fun because it was like we had to think outside the box to, to deal with that. Um, but hey, I'm always down for a rematch, okay? Oh, there will be, yeah, there will be one. Well, guys, that's going to wrap up this battle charity challenge. We won in the first two battles, so we did not have to go to the third battle uh, tiebreaker. Uh, so big thank you to all the players involved. This was so cool to raise money for charity. And uh, I do have the receipts. Uh, the losing team, Fish and Chips, they paid the 100 to St. Jude. Very thankful for them uh, to do that. They were, they were great sports and this was a lot of fun. And they're already looking for a rematch. So I'm sure we're going to do that soon. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. So don't forget, guys, like the video, leave a comment, share. That stuff really does help a lot. And of course, do not forget, support the charities, which are linked down in the video description. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time on the battlefield.